most people think about Recon cameras, you think about the best trail camera on the market today for patterning whitetails. Well, you can also use Reconyx products to make your farm safer and more secure from trespassers and thieves all year long. Let's face it, it's hard enough to pattern and kill a mature whitetail without some idiot messing around. You know, we like to place cameras in any suspect area of our farm that has the potential for access. The most obvious, of course, is the entrance to your farm. But when you're out walking your farm, shed hunting, look for any places that look like someone has or might use to access your property, like a broke down fence line or a creek bottom or even a roadway. Then hang a camera and let it run for a while in a couple of these areas, move it around, just to double check that everyone is following the golden rule. Okay, here's a couple quick tricks to keep in mind when setting up a security surveillance program. If someone's trespassing, seize your camera, you know he's gonna steal it, right? Well, we fix that by using these security enclosures and a python lock. Run the lag bolts through the security enclosure and then set the camera and lock it up with a padlock and a python lock. Another product that's a little easier to use is the C-bracket because once you put the lock bar in place, the camera can't be open so nobody can steal your card. It's not as secure as the security enclosures, but it's a lot easier and much quieter. It's really good to use during the season. Reconyx also makes full line of security cameras like the SM750. This camera is really cool because it's designed to take pictures of a license plate day or night without any reflection you would get from a regular game camera. A great place to hang one of these bad boys is right at your gate so you'll have pictures of every person that rolls by. Make sure to use a security enclosure on this setup. If you don't, you're probably just asking for it. You know, most of the time, just letting people know that you're watching will be enough to keep them on the right side of the fence. So let everybody know what's up with these cool no trespassing signs. It's a good idea to post your property anyway, so you might as well put everyone on notice. Just move on, dude. There's a lot of easier pickings down the road. One of my favorites is to use a dummy camera. These things are like 25 bucks on Reconyx's website. Set this camera out where you know it's easily visible. Don't lock it on so it looks like an easy thing to steal. Then place another camera in a security enclosure inside of the dummy camera. Think it out really good and try to hide the real camera. This can be a really fun thing to do to try to bust someone stealing one of your cameras. So this may seem all a little bit over the top, but two years ago, Pete and I had 14 cameras stolen off of our farm. That was a bad day, but it was a day that we learned a very expensive lesson. So what I'm saying here is at the very least, set up your cameras with code lock and invest in a Python style lock because it's a lot better to be safe than sorry. I hope all this helps. After all the hard work each you put in to grow, hold, and hunt these big old white tails, leave nothing to chance. Secure your farm with your conics and see what you have really been missing.